Hey guys, Hammy here. Thanks very much for tuning in and for your patience. A little bit of a video update for you today, nonetheless, for the channel update. So if you guys haven't tuned in for me before on stream, might be a bit new for you, but I have streamed a bit in the past. You can go and check that out over at twitch.tv forward slash HammyOW. Maybe some streams coming soon. We'll see. A few different things I wanted to have a little bit of a chat about today, uh, just to update you on a few things going on. We're going to have a little bit of chat about the recent video schedule over the last couple of weeks, why that's been a little bit up and down, a little bit about what's coming up on the channel over the coming weeks and months, perhaps a bit of an AMA where I want you guys to ask me some questions within reason of course we'll have a chat about that too 50k subs coming up to that really exciting milestone and what we're going to do for that and the kind of cool and fun things you might like to see as well as some things I've got planned maybe a little bit about patreon and then that'll be us for now so first things first recent video schedule now I know a lot of you folks have been used to sort of up to seven videos a week maybe five at some times but it's never really dropped below four or so or stayed at four until the last couple of weeks so a couple of questions in the comments and things have you gone are the voice lines and law videos still going to be coming I have not gone anywhere and the law videos may certainly are still coming Good news on that. Why has it been a bit quiet over the last couple of weeks? Well, it's been summer. I did do the streaming week for Blizzard where I was featured on the launcher, which was a whole bunch of fun. That cut into my video editing time a bit, just juggling things a little bit around there. And then also last week, uh, or the week before or so, I went to Gamescom. So that was called a little bit of an irregular week. I got to play Eichenwalder, hoping that I pronounced that right this time, jet through Gamescom in a little bit of a hurry. But it was all cool. However, on the way back, and this is part of the reason, uh, bear with me on this story, uh, as to why the schedule has been a little bit up and down in the last few weeks. Um, I was on one of those Belgian, would it have been Belgian? Might have been French, might have been German trains. Uh, I'm going to call it Thales, T-H-A-L-Y-S, but really swanky. Um, I had my single seat uh, that I had my laptop out of and I had my laptop charger plugged into the side. And I took care to position my power brick nicely inside my seat on the floor. The wire was coming out around the side into the side of my laptop. Somehow a train conductor who was walking by managed to put his foot actually kind of inside my seat area, um, yank out my power conductor for my laptop, um, and it went flying away. The conductor sort of apologized and then ran off and then I didn't see him for the rest of the train journey. Um, it seemed to be working okay, so I thought nothing of it. Um, fast forward back to home when it starts sort of having to be put in at a particular funny angle, and then a couple of days earlier this week, um, you can see the, the gaffer tape on the side of here, which you can see the problems I've been having, and then I'm not even sure if you're gonna be able to see that on the webcam. I'll try and give it a go. You can probably see that the end is a little bit, a uh, little bit black there. So, uh, my laptop power conductor decided to start emitting smoke from the power jack on the side of my laptop. Had it, uh, had a look at today. Hopefully, the motherboard isn't fried. I'm really hoping it, but. I'm getting a new jack put into the laptop. Fingers crossed that it will actually charge. I mean, it turns on at the moment, but if it doesn't charge, that may well be bricked. So how am I doing this video for you? I've got a beastly old machine. It's probably about eight years old or so. It's an AMD 4850 for those of you uh, who are up on your graphics cards. So yeah, this is going back a little while. Six cores of AMD runs hot in the sun and making this room very, very toasty at the moment. But it will let me do some basic videos. So good news for you is that uh, video production is not going to stop. It may just be a little bit uh, less, certainly less than the seven a week I've done in the past, maybe sort of four or five or so. And I'm gonna be doing a few different things. Now this actually works kind of quite well anyway in terms of what's coming up. But I just wanted to reassure you, even though I've been delayed recently on hero law voice lines and interactions i've seen a few of you specifically in the comments asking whether that series has stopped it hasn't um, up until yesterday i was working very very hard on trying to get to the anna amari version of that which a lot of you have been asking for along with mercy i know i did Widowmaker a couple of weeks ago previously i know those videos were running once a week once every couple of weeks and then i know that last month in august there was only one um so gamescom streaming and a few things of that slowed those down i tried to put out things like law bites and things which will be continuing as well um it's a bit trickier to film footage from overwatch and to edit on this pc now i can still do it but it's a little bit slower so as to whether it's worth recreating what i've uh tried to do with the Arna video so far. I'll see how we go. But for those of you wanting to see Hero Law Voice Lines Interaction series, they are coming. I've got one that's actually almost done. So I'm just sorting out my PC situation. And then as soon as that's sorted, um, even if it's not sorted, I'll try and see if I can get those videos going again. So please don't worry about those. And plenty of other law stuff I can do that doesn't require a great PC as well. So not to worry on that, um, all will be good. What's gonna be coming up in the coming weeks and the coming months? Well, first things first, as I mentioned earlier, almost 50k subs. Um, I know that I've been releasing a few less videos in the last few weeks, um, 
we should hit 50k from when you watch this maybe sometime in the next two or three days so i'm really looking forward to that um, i have some ideas as to cool things i would like to do there's going to be some sort of retrospective content some kind of more vloggy content i'm going to be trying a few things on a few different games um, those of you who have been tuning in for a while may have had a look at the last channel update i asked you about other games that you'd like to have a look at stuff for so the the one benefit of not having a functioning editing laptop at the moment is that I can actually have a think about scripts and about planning and getting a bit forward and things like that as well, which is kind of cool. So I saw your votes. Um, I've totted up all of the different votes that you stuck in for different games and things like that. A few games, a few franchises definitely came out very strongly in those. So if not over the coming weeks, then certainly over the next month or so, you may see me under Law Bites uh, series for a different game or may see me try and do some law videos about different games that you guys have asked for. So when you see those come, please do let me know what you think. Did you enjoy them? If you like them, then you know, please share them and all that kind of thing. And do, most importantly of all, comment and feedback on what you think I can improve. Um, what else is coming up as well? Well, you may have noticed in the last uh, week or so, um, before Laptop Gate, as it now shall be known, and uh, my laptop may or may not have bitten the dust, I'll find out tomorrow, um, I was trying some, something a bit different in terms of videos. So you may have seen my uh, Sombra ARG summary for the Overwatch uh, lore in the ARG that's been going recently, that's been really, really cool. And also you may have seen my sort of kind of game theory, Overwatch science-y, part lore -y, sort of how could Mercy's healing work and how could Mercy's biotic and healing tech work. Those were really long. Um, I say really long as in like really quite long for sort of YouTube gamey content, shall we say. I mean, both of those actually weighed in at over 17 minutes. The Widowmaker voice lines video I did a, a month or so ago or at the beginning of August, uh, that was kind of a good 14, 15 minutes. Now there are a lot of, you know, people like all kinds of different content on YouTube. There are videos that weigh in at very short, three, four minutes, five minutes. A lot of the stuff that I do tends to be 10 minutes plus. Um, this requires, if it's not just talking over gameplay um, or a news update or something like that, it requires quite a lot of editing, quite a lot of time. So that Mercy video, I can improve my process, but the Mercy video, for example, to produce that 17 minutes took me the best part of, I would say two and a half days, working days, you know, sort of normal, uh, getting up in the morning, working, scripting, uh, finding footage, doing research, checking it, uh, recording the audio, and then sort of the, the editing and things together. I'd say that took the best part of maybe two and a half days or so. So I'd really love some feedback on this longer kind of content that I've been trying. Um, I love doing it. I love spending the time on it. And I know you guys love watching it. Um, do you think it's the kind of thing you'd like to see? Are you happy to mix that uh, with sort of shorter update stuff? Um, there is a thing, you know, I talk about sometimes in the comments about YouTube, the platform, things like that. I love YouTube and everything about it. The platform sometimes makes me feel as if I don't upload daily um, or at least every couple of days, then sort of, you know, in terms of looking at views and, and, and things in terms of moving the channel forward, sometimes it sort of feels that it maybe slows down a little bit. I don't know. But yeah, it'd be really good to hear your thoughts on this longer stuff that I've been doing over the last couple of weeks. Do you watch it all the way through? Do you sort of tune out at a particular point? Is it too long for you? Um, or is it the kind of stuff you'd like to see more of? Um, and then how do you balance that against things like, um, let's take patch notes, patch news and things like that. There are loads of great channels out there do a really, really good job of things like patch notes, the PTR. I've done some of that. A lot of these great channels out there, I'll be honest with you, if I'm working on longer stuff, they might do it quicker than me. Is that, would you still like to see those kind of things from me? Or are they kind of things that you actually watch somewhere else? Um, thanks, do let me know in the comments below what you think about this, because it will really help me in terms of planning out the kinds of videos I make. And you know, if you watch all of those kind of news, the minute that they're sort of released, or the minute that you, um, you hear about them somewhere else, then, that kind of helps. Um, if you'd rather see those somewhere else, I can focus on making longer law related content or things like that for you. But if you'd still like to hear my opinion, those videos, I can make them pretty quick. They don't take me too much time. If I'm talking over gameplay, or if I'm sort of trying to illustrate things in that kind of way, it's, it's certainly a lot quicker than making a, a long video and I can probably still put those out. So do let me know what you think. But a little bit there in terms of what's coming up. Um, the 50K celebration, really excited for that. Uh, may see if we can do a stream, watch this space. I will announce that on Twitter. I may do a little video update to let you know about that as well. And also, um, I'd like to do a little AMA as well. So within reason, if you've got any questions about sort of me, my gaming history and things like that, um, within reason, of course, um, do chuck them in the comments below. I'd love to stick some stuff together for a celebratory 50K uh, subs AMA. And that's gonna be coming up very soon. So please do let me know your questions. I'd love to hear what you think. I'll pick as many as I can, you know, Obviously, if you're, you know, asking me the sort of uh, pin number for my bank card or something like that, then you're probably not going to get an answer. But like I said, you know, within reason, it's all good. So yeah, please do shout some questions in the comments below, and I'd love to uh, answer a bunch of those as part of the 50k AMA stuff. I'm probably going to do some things like 
a, a few sort of videos about like you know my life in other games in terms of what other games I've played over uh, the many sort of dad 76 sort of years comparatively speaking that I've been playing games and about a bit about how sort of the kinds of things I got out of them kinds of ways that they shape sort of like how I like games and my gaming experience and things so they'll be sort of part vloggy part edited part sort of reminiscing and things like that so I'll, I'll do some cool stuff like that as well um, as well as yeah trying some lore series and trying some game theorish videos for other games that you guys have requested from the comments so a big thanks for that um last but not least very soon i think i'm probably going to give patreon a go so i'm going to get myself set up on patreon and i would really i've asked about this in other channel updates but i would really love your feedback uh, particularly in terms of uh patreon and how if you support anyone on patreon you do it you know do you like just being able to choose you know whether you support them with a dollar a month or five dollars a month or, or however much you feel comfortable with and not having to worry about the rewards or sort of a very simple set of rewards or do you um, prefer to have like a big tier list of rewards and you know some of them might be not for you some of them might be for you and you can sort of have a look at a whole big menu of rewards and sort of see what you fancy um, for those of you not familiar with what patreon is it's a way that creators can be supported by fans, their sort of communities, uh, to make content in a way that helps the creator not be so reliant on the whims and trials and tribulations and the black box that might be sort of online advertising. That's probably a subject for another time. I've got this Patreon video planned where I explain it all. Um, it's entirely optional and even if you decide that Patreon is not for you but you love watching my content, you love watching my videos and you subscribe here, um, you type in the comments, you share them with your friends, then please keep doing that you know, watching, commenting away, sharing stuff and being a subscriber on YouTube and following all my vids. That is one of the most valuable kinds of support I can have. So thank you, thank you, thank you so much for that. Please don't stop doing it. And as always, if there's any way that I can improve videos, different things I can try, things that you've watched in videos and think, you know what, you can do a better job here. I like this, but I don't like that so much. Please do let me know. I'd love to hear from you. Bro, that is my slight waxing of lyricalness. Um, if you enjoyed this or if this was a bit different for you, well, I'm going to be trying some more things like this, but with more themes and topics around uh, 50k and my gaming history and all that kind of stuff. So stay tuned for more of this. Um, but yeah, certainly over the next few days, we're going to have a few more sort of lore light kind of videos, sort of shorter form edited videos, whatever this uh, beastly old machine below me can handle when it comes to editing. And then we'll have a whole bunch of stuff planned for 50k uh, sub celebration and onwards as well. Keep an eye out for a few giveaways and things there. Thanks so much for tuning in. Really, really good to see you. Um, do let me know anything that you think about anything I've said in the comments below. Hello, I'll jump in the comments and I really look forward to hearing what you all think. Not going away. Thank you for your support. Thank you for getting me to 50k and for all of us getting to 50k. I'm so excited by that. And here's to 100. Let's set our goals big and set our eyes to the future as well. Just tuning in. I've been Hammy. Take it easy.